6 ounces of caster sugar, 6 ounces of butter or margarine, 3 eggs and a tablespoon of milk. Step 1. Before making the mixture, put your oven on to 180 degrees and line your cupcake tin with the cases. Then, to start the mixture, mix the butter and caster sugar together until light and fluffy. Then, what we need to do is crack an egg into the mixture. There goes the margarine. Mm -hmm. Mixing the margarine with the flour. Keep working it in. And then, crack an egg. And mix up until all are mixed well. Quite heavy on the elbows. There we go. Add the remaining self-raising flour, mix carefully and thoroughly until you get a good mixture. There we go. Extra flour. Keep adding it in. More flour. Starting to get a lot thicker now. Look at the texture, look at the consistency. This is how it should be getting. A lot of mixing. This is done in real time, so you could actually kind of do this at the same time as you're doing yours. There, we're a tablespoonful of milk. I've got a nice red little kind of a measurer here. And mix it up. A lot more mixing. Look at the texture there. Not too thick, not too runny. There we go. A bit closer in. Yeah. You can see the fork. You can see the fork moving in there. Move all that mixture into the prepared cases. I usually find about one large spoon will, will fill each one. Okay, now shove it into the oven for around 10 to 15 minutes or until raised golden brown and cooked in the middle. Depends on your oven. There we go. Brown, raised in the middle. Mm. Now, you can check they're cooked by putting a knife through the bun and making sure the knife comes out clean. Now, let's decorate the cupcakes. You need a knob of butter with a small amount of icing sugar. Okay, mix it all in together and then we're going to add a drop of milk. Yep, a drop of milk and also a drop of food colouring. We're going to go for a nice kind of pink one here. So a drop two of the red food colouring mix. Mm. You could, of course, have green ones or purple ones or anything you like. OK, now I'm putting all this stuff into the icing bag. Right, the icing, the icing is now quite thick and creamy and it's ready to go. Holding it nice and steady like this. Pipe the, pipe the icing around the edge of the cupcakes and meet in the middle of the cupcake. Now 
Now, after you've done the icing, you can decorate your cupcakes with a choice of sprinkles or decorations. And that is how to make and decorate the perfect cupcakes. Lovely. Hope you've enjoyed this. Keep an eye on my other videos for how to make other recipes. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.